A story often told about the invention of chess, which, by the way, is not today's topic, goes like this. The inventor asked the king for one grain of rice on the first square and to double it on every next one. Sounds simple, until the 64th square, where it explodes into over 18 quintillion grains of rice, enough to cover the entire planet because you can see on the screen what it looks like to write 18 quintillion. But that's the old story. Today I'm telling you something even crazier. A real discovery by one of the most brilliant minds ever, Claude Shannon, who found something about chess that will completely blow your mind. Claude Shannon was an American mathematician, engineer, and genius who literally invented information theory, the foundation of how computers, the internet, and even artificial intelligence work today. Imagine the contributions he made setting the foundation for computers, the internet, and even artificial intelligence. But here's what most people don't know. Shannon was also a passionate chess player. And one day he asked himself a wild question, how many possible games of chess could exist? What he discovered will blow your mind. We will cover it quickly. Let's start small. When the game begins, white has just 20 possible moves. Simple enough. Then black replies, and by that point, there are already 400 unique board positions. Not crazy yet, right? Yeah, I can understand. But here's where it gets insane. After just three moves, the number of possible positions explodes to over 9,000. And by the time each player has made 10 moves, the total possibilities jump to around 69 trillion. Check on the screen how to write 69 trillion. Let that sink in. Just 10 moves, and the game has already entered a universe of unimaginable possibilities. So Claude Shannon did the math. After analyzing the branching of every move, every position, and every possible outcome, he estimated that chess has around 10 to the power of 120 possible games. That's a number so big it's almost impossible to imagine. To put that in perspective, the entire observable universe contains only about 10 to the power of 82 atoms. That means there are more possible games of chess than atoms in the entire universe. Listen to it again. Let me repeat it for you. More chess games than atoms that exist in the whole universe. You know, in 0.1 gram of water, there is 1 times 10 to the 22nd power or 10 sextillion. It's not just a board game anymore. It's a mathematical universe created by humans, yet infinite in its possibilities. And that's exactly why chess will never get old. Even the greatest computers and grandmasters have barely explored a tiny fraction of what's possible on this 8x8 battlefield. So next time you play chess, remember, every move you make might be one that has never been played before in the entire history of the universe. If that doesn't make you love chess even more, I don't know what will. If you like the video, hit the like button, subscribe for more mind-bending chess content, and tell me in the comments what you think about Claude Shannon's discovery. Thanks for watching, and as always, let's make every move a power move.